The Utah Transit Authority is looking to the future with new goals and objectives to reach by 2030. Fox 13 News reporter Jenna Bree shows us how UTA wants to drive the economy and the environment. Thousands of Utahns board a UTA bus or train in five minutes every single day. If I'm only getting from point A to point B, I don't need to drive there if there's something else available. Mill Creek resident Amanda Ott says she wishes more commuters took advantage of public transit. She understands that it's not accessible to everyone. I find it helpful not having to drive here and then driving home in traffic every day. And I think for people who don't live in the city but need access to the city, it would be super helpful. Yeah. Last week, UTA's Board of Trustees approved the agency's 2030 strategic plan, giving the agency a new motto, we move you, and laying out ambitious goals for the future. And while they're nervous about a few of them, about whether or not we can hit them, we think that they're important and we do think they're reachable. Moving Utahns to a better quality of life involves two objectives, making transit more available to everyone and reducing UTA's carbon footprint. And Utah County's slated to double in its population size. We certainly have a lot of growth happening in the southwest part of Salt Lake County and, and they've expressed some concerns. UTA aiming to reduce its carbon footprint by 25 percent. Uh, we have a uh, a, a strategy to convert about half of our buses to electric buses over the next 20 years. Uh, that certainly will help. But Board of Trustees Chair Carlton Christensen says UTA can't achieve any of its goals without being able to attract and retain employees, something that's forced them to reduce service already this year. And if we're going to continue to grow at a pace that's uh, one of the highest in the nation, uh, transit has to be part of that answer. UTA also aiming to get the community to recognize UTA's economic value. For some reason with public transportation, there's like a stigma that people are like, oh, like you take public transportation. But like in reality, it's way better than people think it is. In Salt Lake City, Jenna Bree. Fox 13 News, Utah.